Lulu. Where are you going? I didn't want to bother you. I can't sleep, actually. I was lying here trying to imagine what I was going to tell your father if something happened to you. Well, nothing happened. We got on the next helicopter out, and look, he was on it with me. I just don't know how many more people Jax is going to be able to rescue. I'm so glad you got out. Are you going to get mushy on me? I can't get over the fact that you never left my side. I find myself uncustomarily proud and very grateful to be your step monster. Everything is so chaotic in general, it's just hard to tell who's been evacuated and who hasn't. Well, we know that you and Lucky made it out, and my father and Monica got out. Nicholas is still there. Nicholas has survived many a disaster. He is a seasoned pro. But nobody's heard from Carly or Jason or my friend Spinelli. Do me a favor. Don't mention Jason to my father. My father has been through enough aggravation to last a lifetime, and quite frankly, I couldn't possibly hold his hand through another Jason crisis. I used to think that this, the way you are right now, was all that there was to you, you know, the selfishness and the hatred and how everything revolves around you. Everything does revolve around me. No, oh. you're not fooling me. I don't think you know me, Missy. I know you. I know you love my dad. I know you care about me. <laughs> I know that you would die for your kids, and I think that you do love Monica and your dad. Okay, well, thank you for the lovely speech. Now make yourself useful. Go find out who else was evacuated. And perhaps you could find out why your father hasn't come to rescue us yet. Copy machine only had four options. I'm pretty sure you would hate them all, so I uh, got you my favorite. Mocha Madness. Mmm. Thanks. Did you happen to get a hold of your father? Um, you know, my dad doesn't always answer his phone or check his messages, and it doesn't mean anything. It wouldn't bother you if your, uh, Tandi Zakara didn't answer the phone? By the way, where is your doting boyfriend? My doting boyfriend and I had a fight. I don't know if he's in Port Charles. I don't even know if he knows about the fire or anything. And what was the fight? I don't want to talk about this. No, you'd rather crawl back on your hands and knees and do anything he asks just to make it all better, hmm? I was stupid. And the fight didn't have to get as dramatic as it was, but it did. Do not diminish yourself for any man. Do you understand but me? But what if I was the one that overreacted? Don't be so quick to make yourself wrong, Lulu. No man is going to respect you if you don't respect yourself. Take it from me. You just want to make sure that Johnny and I stay broken up. Yeah, well, that too.